it's still craziness here this hour. It's crazy. This Sunday is a crazy busy Sunday. Okay, it's time, buddy. <laughs> it is time. You want to see it? What is that? And there were a lot of questions about how we do things, what we do, and I'm just going to show you guys. I'm not going to always be here to do everything for them, so they need to learn to do things on their own. I still have my suit on from today. Today was the first time that I've been to a meeting uh, and not being the elders quorum president in a couple of years. And it was very interesting not to have extra meetings and whatnot today. And we did uh, go after church and we went and did what we call tithing declaration. And so we are asked in the Bible, uh, we are asked in the scriptures to give 10% of our gain uh, back to the Lord in some way. And so that's uh, declaring that we, it's a tithe, that's, that's a tithing. And so we, uh, at the end of the year, we meet and uh, do tithing declaration, basically saying, yes, we've paid our tithe. Anyway, so we just got got through doing that with a, as a family. We got two of the uh, temple dedication recommends for Az and Canyon. And so that's going to be happening soon. We have a temple dedication happening here. And Sarah's making bread, kids are coming over for dinner, boys are going to go to choir, Savannah's going to a meeting. It's still craziness here this hour. It's crazy. This Sunday is a crazy busy Sunday. What are you drinking? Hot chocolate from Riley. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What are you doing with the bread? Taking it out of the pans. But what are we doing with it? Is that uh -huh. here you giving it away? One of them, yeah. We'll eat one, we'll give one away. That's how it works, yo. Okay, hey, it's time, buddy. <laughs> it is time. I know, it's a cool camera, huh? Look, you wanna see it? I wanna see it. I think he already sees it. Look. What is that? <laughs> oh, <stop>. Remember? <laughs> Remember that time? He's like, wait, there's more. Yeah. Who's this guy? Who's this Jesse one? Jesse and Buzz and Woody. Remember that time before when you guys were just barely married when we moved down here? Or not even married when we moved That's down Jesse here. Jesse and the dinosaur. And I told dad that we needed to buy these for our future grandkids. And he said, how could I ever say no to our future grandkids? It's a true story. I got out the, the baby toys to get out all the Toy Story things. Because I've been looking for these for little people, Toy Story. Yeah. And I can't find them anywhere. And I was so sad. And then I got out the bin to get out the... Toy Story toys last night, and they were in there. <laughs> I had already bought them and didn't remember. He's like, I don't care about Bo Peep. Come on, where's Buzz? <laughs> Buzz? Buzz? He's so <laughs> cute. Oh, oh look. <laughs> oh, wow. Look inside. Open. Oh, oh no! <laughs> It's oh. bullseye! He's a little overwhelmed, I think. <laughs> oh, oh I'm so great! <laughs> I killed Jesse! <laughs> oh no! I turned it into a tree! Woody! Woody! It is a Toy Story in here, yo. What do you think, Neymar? It's Toy Story and Mickey Mouse. Oh, okay, we have Mickey Mouse too. Thank you, Bucky. Yeah? Okay, so we're, we're having a discussion here. We're having a, dis we're having, we're having a discussion here. And Asbury, Asbury, if metal contracts, stone, wood, carpet, synthetics, whatever you want to put it, if it all contracts when it gets cold, <laughs> why and how does ice expand? <laughs> how does water expand? 
<laughs> you should know. You're the science guy. Mars Canyon? I'm the science guy. Mars explained it to us, but it was way over all our heads. But what if you put ice in a skull shaped silicone mold or water? I don't know. Let's see if it actually comes out Does as skulls. Does it come skulls. out as skulls? Oh, oh, are you serious? Ooh. Those are actually nitrogen? pretty rad. They are cool. Jeez. That's so cool. Dang. I want that one. Don't touch it. That's pretty cool. That is really cool. Wait, wait, wait. So we, as you can see over there, we have our kitchen table that we are not eating on still because we don't have any glass on it yet. So we're eating up to the island. This, this is what a food hangover looks like. <laughs> <laughs> When your legs are tucked up underneath of your pelvis, <laughs> you're reaching for the floor here, and your face is, your eyes are wide open and your face is smashed into the bread. <laughs> few days. Actually what we're hearing is it actually probably won't be till the end of the week that this will no longer happen. So what we have is this big opening in here. If you look right here, you can see back here. We were supposed to originally have an area where we could put tables and different things in here, but that, that, that stopped us from that happening. So we may still put something in here or you can put tables or whatever inside of there. But anyway, that's that's what this is. This is a door. It's not properly put on here yet. We gotta get a hinge for the for this side right here. But that has been, uh, the vacuum's been going underneath of there. Neymar comes over and rolls the ball and so it goes underneath of there, toys. Uh, because there's no kick plate around this island or around the cabinets. That's what they're hopefully gonna be doing on Thursday or Friday is they can even put the crown in up there uh, last week, early last week, yeah. but they haven't come back. And once you get a contractor to come to your house, you almost don't want them to leave until they're done because they probably won't come back. And that's what we're experiencing right now is dude came, did a good job, but then he never came back. So we're trying to get him to come back. So this is the, this is the reason I, Got down underneath there, because this vacuum is the best one we have. New rollers underneath of it. Oh, it needs cleaned. But my nighttime routine consists of, well, Sarah's helping me with it right now, making sure there's nothing on the floor. Going around making sure there's nothing on the floor that can be sucked up in the vacuum. Shoelaces hanging off the side of shoes. Little papers that get sucked up into the vacuums. And then going around and making sure the vacuums are turned on, charging or charged and ready to go for morning. They go on at 7 a.m. And that is how we keep our floors clean. Lots and lots happens here on Sunday night. We have family over and kids running around here and, and stuff falling on the ground. And, and so that's, that's again, part of my nighttime routine is to make sure that these little things like this are not on the floor. This right here, the vacuum will stop with something like that. This, it won't stop, but it may get uh, blocked. So I just put it up here with Kenya stuff and then this right there. Now that you know my nighttime routine, next time you get to help. Sarah and I recently got to speak with Canyon as Lizzie and Savannah at a little uh, YouTube kind of uh, teaching moment. And uh, there were a lot of questions about how we do things, what we do. And I'm just gonna show you guys part of the other Sunday night routine. Pretty much every Sunday night because Monday morning, our operations manager, Lane, comes in and takes something from us. And that is this. These right here are our cameras. Three of them, and then the one that you're seeing right now, this one. So what we do is we come in here and we drop the cards. All these have footage on them from the week. Every single one of them have footage on them from the week. Pull all those out, put them right there, and then I pull the one out from here, and I go and switch it with cards that have already been cleared and there's nothing on them. And then that way these cameras, beginning Monday morning, have all of the all, all the cards that are in them are cleared and ready to go for the week. And then the other cards can be put into a hard drive and then up to the cloud 
and that's uh, that's kind of the it is the routine for our, these cameras right here. So there they are right there. Three out of the four. And four of our other ones are ready to be picked up at Best Buy. True, because we broke them. So this is the other camera. I'll show you in the reflection here. You see it right there. That's the newest member of our family. That's the camera right there that you're looking at. If we turn it this way, you can see. That's it right there. So you can see it's much different than these ones. These all have the mics on top and whatnot, so you may be getting a different sound out of this. In fact, after we see this footage and after we hear the sound from this, we may switch up. We may not like it for what we do, but I totally love using this camera because as you saw just now, the sunset is absolutely amazing and it's the first camera I've seen pick up the sunset that's close to what I'm actually seeing through my eyes. So I'm really excited for that part because sunsets just are never done justice through a camera or even a cell phone. A uh, cell phone does, it's close, but it's nothing like this camera. The boys have gotten to a place in their life where if they want something that's not like 100% on my radar right now, like I have to get it done, they know that I get too distracted and have other things I'm focusing on and so they just have to do it themselves. Like their Christmas tree, which isn't a bad thing because I'm not going to always be here to do everything for them, so they need to learn to do things on their own, which is great that they wanted enough to get the Christmas tree out, that they found it, and put it up by themselves. I helped them keep this, make the star so it stayed on the top, but like Lizzie, she wants hers now, but she's just waiting until I find it for her for Christmas, so hers won't go up until I get out the Christmas stuff after Thanksgiving. It's all about your wants and desires, guys. If you desire it, make it happen. Don't wait for someone else to do it for you. Da, 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 Your Christmas tree da, is so da, cute. Da, 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 da. Okay, no night, boys. Okay, good night, boys. I love you. I love you. We, we love, love you guys, guys so much. And as always.